Hi guys, I'm going to install the exam saver in my MacBook Pro M4 Pro for the first time. So I already downloaded this. You will find it using this URL. So I will include in the video description. You can go ahead and download. And here is the file. We can uh, click open on this. And here we have to right click on this application and click open. But it will not allow us to install. It shows exam is kind of a malware. So what we can do, go to settings. Okay. And uh, go to privacy and security. Now in the below, it shows exam OS X uh, was blocked to protect your Mac. You have to click open anyway. And open anyway. And you have to enter your password for the Mac or enter your fingerprint. Alright. Now the password. Okay. Okay. Now you can right click on this installer. Click open. Now it will ask you a password again. I will click next, next, next. All right, it is getting installed. All right, after a couple of minutes, it's got installed. We are going to finish it. Now we got the page like this, our local host path. So let me go ahead and uh, show you in our launch pad. If we scroll to right, we will see this exam. Uh, folder and here we got manager OS X. Using this application, we will be able to turn on MySQL database, which is with PHP MyAdmin and a Budge web server, which is a local host. So, where we can find our public HTML folder. So, let me go ahead and show you. If, if you open this manager OS X application, you will see this open application folder button click it in this if you scroll you will see this HD docs folder inside this where you can put your web pages for example I'm going to create a new web page called hello world inside this we are going to create some uh, HTML file I'm going to use the terminal for it and I have to bring this uh, folder part do this okay now I'm in that folder. I can go ahead and write the command touch in index.html. Now we can go to hello world and here we got our file. We can open this using Visual Studio Code or any other editor. I'm going to instantly put some code here HTML, body, uh, some p tag. I'm going to enter hello world. Okay. Now to open that uh, folder using the browser, we can go to firstly localhost. We can try. We get the same page. Now, as we remember, the folder name was hello world. We can enter hello world. Now we got our text hello world. Because of this p tag, I'm going to change this hello good afternoon. I don't know what is the time of. You know, now we can see it get changed real time. All right, now about PHP my admin, you can use localhost or slash PHP my admin. Now, this is our PHP my admin. If we go to user accounts, we will see username is root and currently no passwords available. You can enter your username as root, password as nothing. Okay, you don't have to enter anything. You can create databases and do whatever you want all right so that is it for this video if this video helps please subscribe thank you